adding repair orders in Lot Wizard. First thing we need to do is come to the right side here, come down to Inventory Detail. Then we need to load the vehicle in which we're going to add repair orders to. You can come down to the bottom here and click Load. The inventory list will come up. And I need to find a 1989 Jeep. So in the year I'm going to type in 1989 and there's my Jeep. Highlight the vehicle. Click Load Vehicle and the vehicle's loaded. Now we need to come up to the Pricing tab towards the top here. Over to the right, click on Pricing. You'll notice in the middle column here, about halfway down is Repair Orders. We can go ahead and click on Repair Orders. And the Repair Order window will open. We replaced the windshield and then we also replaced tires and did alignment. So first one I'm going to enter is the windshield. So I'm going to click Add. And the RO number is ready. I can just start typing. I'm going to assign it a number of 01. I hit the tab key and goes over to RO date. Hit the tab key and I go over to vendor. Now if you added vendors in here before, they'll be in your list. But I know this one is a new vendor, so I can just start typing it in. And it's Mike's Auto Glass. And then I hit the tab key. And it'll say, do you wish to add Mike's Auto Glass to the RO vendor list? I'm going to say yes, that way it's there if I need it again. And then, right now I'm highlighted on the detail. But I, I don't need the detail for this one. I can tab over to the cost. And it was $211.89. And now I can add the second RO. So I'm going to go ahead and click Add again. Give it a RO number of 02. Tab over. Today's date is fine. And then I'm going to tab over to Vendor. This time it was Ace Auto. And I want to put in details because I did tires and alignment. So I can tab over again. And you'll notice right here there's a button. You can actually click on there and you can add detail lines. So I'm going to click Add. And a part number, I'm just going to put 01, description, tires, tab over to the price, $245, and then I'm going to click add again, give it a part number of 02, type in alignment, and that was $127. And you'll notice it's totaling it up here down at the bottom right. And it also totals it up out on the main screen. So once I'm done adding in the details, I can click Close. And you'll notice it totals up the second line at Ace Auto for the tires and the alignment. And then it actually totals everything up down here at the bottom for the whole page. So that is how you add repair orders in Lot Wizard. So go ahead and click Close. Now if you want to add vendors or delete vendors, you can go up to Maintenance. Come down to RO Vendors, and your RO Vendor Maintenance window will open. And in here is all the vendors that you have. And you can simply maintain these if you wish to delete one. You can highlight it, click Delete at the bottom. And if you wish to add one, you just click Add. And we can type in Joe's Garage. And then just once you're done with the maintenance, click Save and Exit. So that is how you keep track of repair orders and maintain the vendors list in LotWizard. Thank you for watching.